gathered here in the sight of God to witness these two people united in holy matrimony. Where are you going, buddy? Now, Patrick, if you will place the ring upon the third finger of Jackie's left hand. <laughs> By the power invested in me, I pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss the bride. <laughs> kiss the way you smile when you look my way. Your crazy moves make me laugh all day. It's the butterflies I get inside when I feel your heart beat next to mine. Love. 
you sparkles like a diamond ring. Love, you find it in the little things. This is perfectly clear. There's no doubt that's what love. So what do you think? They make a pretty good couple. Yeah, they seem happy it's enough. Hands in a matinee. It's a fine uh oh, it's Jimmy Sanders. It's a top down drive me the autumn. What do you say, Andrea? Time for a little soccer? I'd say. It sounds good to me. Love, you find it in the little things. It's perfectly clear. There's no doubt. That's what love is all about. <laughs> Perfectly clear, but there's no doubt that's what love is all about. <laughs> Who's going to help me carry Mom over the threshold? <laughs> I think you're going to have your hands full just with the presents and the kids. Come on. <laughs> Never mind. Isn't that what they do in, like, old movies or something? <laughs> All, All right, everybody buddy. out. Let's go. Okay, everybody grab some presents. Let's get this thing off of you. Okay, I got these. Are you all right back there? Ah! Um, what do you think Dad's thinking right now? You mean because I've remarried? Yeah. Do you think he knows? I'm sure he does. I think he's very happy for us. You think he's happy? I'm sure I do. I know he'd like Patrick. And... He'd be very happy that I found someone who loves us so much. Yeah, he does love us a lot. Remember, you can talk to your dad about him anytime. He'd like to hear what you have to say. I do. It's just, I wish I could hear him talking back. I know. Night. Night.
Town this morning. She gave me the slip. But at some point, all little doggies gotta come home. So we're gonna grab her tonight, right? Webster, you're talking about breaking and entering. You do not break and enter without doing all your homework first. You got the first watch, right? Enter and break. What's that? Well, it's a combination jackknife, screwdriver, whistle. My grandfather gave it to my father, and my father gave it to me. You should have it. Oh, are you sure? I'm sure. Thanks. Always brought me good luck. So what? Uh, Mom's gonna pick you up, all right? I gotta go to the library. No problem, bro. Bye, buddy. Hey, Tammy! Come on, buddy, let's go. First day of school and all. <laughs> well, I'm Emma Putter, but you can all call me Emma. I'll be helping you all with the fundamentals for today. Football is a challenging sport that we can all enjoy if you just understand the basics. Coach Emma, I thought we were here to play soccer. Yeah. We are. Soccer and football are synonymous. What's synonymous? Beats me. Well, how about we get started? Okay. <laughs> Stand still as our feelings grow and it turns me around when I see a smile and it picks me up when I'm feeling down and it spins me round when I see a smile and it picks me up when I'm feeling Good one, and um, I'll see you all tomorrow at three. 
from England. I overheard you were going to school at Elman. Farnfield High School. Emma. Yeah. Emma, how am I first step? Please help. Excuse me, somebody needs my help. We'll see you around. Hi, Mom. Oh, hey, Mom. <laughs> Why are you still here? Um, I wasn't sure if you'd remember to, uh, to pick up Andrea. Oh, I see. Well, I'll, uh, I'll see you around. When I see you smile and it picks me up. When I'm feeling down. Oh, Mrs. Brinson, you will not leave. I'm just going to. Hey, over here. That's her, the girl in the purple. All we need are three more players for the football team. The coach will take anybody who shows up at this point. Those guys are so cute in their uniforms. What time's practice today? I'm gonna come watch. After last class. Sorry, pal. Gotta go. Yes, you should come. It's oh. really a blast. Jordy, pass over here, man. Oh, I gotta stretch hands. We're okay. Shh, coach, coach. Come on, guys. Well, is this everyone? Excuse me. Ready, coach. All right, for, uh, for everyone's information, uh, shin guards uh, are the only required padding in soccer. Well, this is, this is good, but uh, before we can field a team, we need two more players. Anybody? Count me in, coach. Hey, there's no room here for basketball players. The team's full. I only count nine. That means there's two spots left. Settle down, boys. There's room on the field for everybody. <clears throat> Are you really gonna play with all that off? Uh, no. All right. Okay. Um, physical contact is a penalty, right, Coach? <laughs> mm, yeah. Okay. The idea is to keep the ball moving. Try to anticipate any opportunity. All right. Let's see what we got. Yeah. I try to see the bright side. Okay, come on, guys. Let's oh, go. That's a lot. I got it. I got it. Let's go. That's it. Lost the sudden point. Josh, take a joker. Oh, watch it. Oh, come on, Josh. Get out of here. Now we're starting at the bottom. Por favor. Nice moves, Potter. Hey, do you want to show me sometime? Yeah. Okay. Okay, team, gather round. <whistles> Sam, you're up. 
Watch and learn. I dare anybody, <coughs> even that mutt, to get the ball past me. I'll put it by you. <laughs> what is he talking about? Does he not understand that's Air Bud? <laughs> Buddy, come here. here we go. All right, way to go, buddy. Come on, let's see you do this. Come here. Just hit the ball in the net, right? Right there. Let's go. Come on, flea bag. I haven't got all day. <laughs> go on down. Coach, can he play? I guess, uh... I guess we just found our missing player. Yeah, all right. Yeah. All right. Awesome, Way to go, buddy. buddy. Awesome. Uh, why'd you move to Fernfield? So after Mum passed away, Daddy decided we needed a change, and we moved here. Sorry about your mom. It's okay. Listen, um, Josh, Daddy wants to throw a bash for the team. Would you like to come? It's, uh, it's Friday at 7 o'clock. Unless, of course, uh, you've got other plans. No. I can fit that into my schedule. Great. See you here? Yeah. Okay. Come on, Molly. I can fit that into my schedule? I blew that one, didn't I? Mm -hmm. Okay. Just one announcement. I'm moving the next practice, which was originally scheduled for this Saturday, to right now. What? Coach, we just played a whole game. What game? I didn't see a game. I saw one team playing soccer, and I saw another team playing hog the ball. What's the most important part of soccer? No contact? <laughs> the eyes. Where's the ball going next? Who can I pass to? How can I 
create space to open myself up to receive a pass. I just watched you guys for an hour and a half out there. And aside from Emma and Buddy here, I don't believe I saw one given go. But I guarantee you, before the night's over, you'll know what it is to pass. <laughs> All right? Okay, come on, let's go. Uh, tight, 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 tight. Good. Oh, 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 my God. Emma's having a party. You going? Party? What party? When? All right. Pick in the middle. Buddy, you be the pig. <laughs> so to speak. Keep away. Come on, buddy. Keep away. Bring it on, man. Come on. Oh. Hey. Emma's having a party on Friday. You going? Yeah. Me too. I figure I should wear something kind of English. She must be instinctively attracted to something like that. Yeah, sure she is. Nice energy. Hey. All right. Oh. Now you're playing soccer. All right. Our next game is against the league champions, the Springbrook Spartans. However, last year and so far this year, they are undefeated. Oh. It's like clockwork. What makes you so sure he's sneaking? Trust me, I'm an expert. our pesky pooch. Over. Josh. Hey, man. Hey. So, 
What do you think? Nice skirt. Kill. Chicks dig a guy with a sense of fashion. Is Buddy here? Come on in. Tom, is your family Scottish? Uh, no. <laughs> hey, Tom, did you bring your bagpipes? <laughs> Very funny. <laughs> it's a nice place. You have to forgive me. We're absolutely higgledy piggledy right now. Oh. Daddy's not been able to engage a butler. He's trying to manage this whole affair with Mrs. Brimstone. Oh, do you need some help or something? Could you? Yeah. Is this being a peeping Tom? No, that's just guys. That's why they call it Tom. We are managing. Oh, <laughs> yeah. shortcake. Uh, no. It's the end, I tell you, Mr. Potter. The end. We'll manage, my dear. It's not the Queen's Royal Ball. I'll get that. Oh, I'm, I'm Josh. Here, take this to the kitchen. That way. One sack, all right? There we go. Hello. <laughs> That's better. Well done, Josh. Yeah, I was getting a bit closer there, but I'm all right. <laughs> you have my gratitude, Josh. That's all right. <laughs> Thank you so much, Mrs. Brimstone. Uh, yeah. You saved the day, Josh. Oh, it's no problem. That's an odd pocket knife. Yeah, my stepdad gave it to me. <laughs> What's that? Oh, it's just some muscle, I guess. Quite the party. 
<laughs> yes, it was a bit of the odd, all right, wasn't it? <laughs> well, um, it was a pleasure meeting you, Josh. Yeah, you too. Yes. Cheerio. Yeah. So, um, I was thinking maybe, uh, I don't know, maybe sometime. Emma, I'd... there you are. I've got to talk to you. Let's go. <laughs> if I ask after your general state of health? I mean, do you feel that you're physically capable of performing the necessary duties of household butler? Oh, no. You don't fool me for one minute. I had dinner with the Queen. Yes. Well, thank you very much. Uh, Mrs. Brimstone will see you out. <laughs> thank you. Uh, will Webster the Third? Oh, show him in. Exactly my point. Oh, quite, Come, yes. sir. Please. This way. Oh, my, yes. <laughs> On my word. <laughs> Good evening, sir. Good afternoon, uh, Mr. Uh, Webster. Would you sit down? You can call me Willie, actually. Very well, um, Willie. Um, have you ever done this sort of work before? Ah, uh, I worked in an advisory capacity in the uh, canine division. So you know dogs? Well, that's extraordinary. <laughs> Very good. Well, it's just that our, our daughter's retriever hasn't been feeling well lately. Uh, or perhaps you could diagnose. Mm -hmm. Well done, old chap. You seem to be just the man. <laughs> Welcome aboard. Oh, uh, Mrs. Brimstone! Mm -hmm. I'd like you to meet our new butler, mm. Willie. This is uh, Mrs. Brimstone, our house manager. Charmed, I'm sure. <laughs> <laughs> they got a girl on the team? No rule against it. All the better for us. Gentlemen, take the field. Now, who's this, uh, buddy Fran? Retriever. That would be the dog, coach. Mascot? Starting forward. Hey, buddy! <laughs> That's a bit of the old desperate measures, or what, huh? <laughs> well, it looks like we can get along without you for this one, son. Yeah, but Dad, it's, it's their butt. Take it. Yeah. Oh. 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 
Maybe, uh, sometime you want to go two-way on... A, a what? You know, like a movie or something. Maybe Saturday. Josh, we're in the middle of a game. How... Yes! That'd be lovely. All right. Yeah! That team's only been playing three lousy weeks. I'd say this won't look good on the stat sheet, Chief. Yeah, well, if you think I'm gonna stand by and put up with this kind of nonsense, girls, dogs, what's next? A water buffalo? Coach, I have a dog you could play. Oh. <clears throat> well, I hope you enjoyed your little bit of fun, Montoya. I have to tell you that as uh, chairman of the conference, I intend to initiate a protest. Well, I'm sorry you feel that way. I thought your team played with a lot of courage. All right, here's the thing. Do not, under any circumstances, let her know that you like her too much. It's the key point, the bottom line. I do like her, though, Tom. Well, I know that, but you gotta keep her guessing. That's right, Josh. Just listen to Casanova. Thanks a lot. Enjoy it. thing so far? Yeah. Figure I'll put in another year and then hop on my hog and hit the road. Your what? Motorcycle. You have a motorcycle. Not yet, but I mean, I will get one. Next, please. Um, two for a ninja buddy ninja, please. Okay. There you go. Thanks. You're welcome. Are you sure about this movie? It sounds sort of violent. Down left. I like violent movies. <laughs> Are you all right? Yeah. Sure, babe. Ouch. Seemed like that movie really got to you. What do you mean? You know, the way you kept covering your eyes. I did. And screaming. Oh, 
I always do that in, in like movies. I see. Josh, can I ask you a question? Sure, babe. First of all, my name is Emma, not Babe. What has gotten into you? Why are you acting this way? What way? You're being a twit. I am. I said I'd go out with you, not some hipster nutcase, and take off those ridiculous sunglasses. We're at your house already. Good night, Josh. Good night. Can I call you, or... You can call me if you want, or whatever, I mean... You can call me. I'm gonna kill Tom. better night than me, looking at the loser of the universe. So how'd the big date go? Don't ask. Is that bad, huh? Worse. Just don't know how dumb you're acting until afterwards. Sometimes it just takes patience. But when it's meant to work out, She'll be there. I'm not so sure after what happened tonight. No faith in yourself. It goes a long way. Thanks. All right. I'll see you in the morning. Yeah. you have a little problem. What's wrong? I've just come from a meeting of the athletic conference, of which, as I'm sure you're aware, I'm the chairman. We, uh, the conference has uh, decided to disqualify your team. What? what? Why? You can't do that, can you? Oh, come on, Jack, that's ridiculous. And for your information, he's been on other Fernfield High teams. That dog has all the rights that this conference gives him. And this conference says he can't play. Play. Now, you either remove him from your team, or you remove your team from the league. The choice is yours. Moose, give me the ball. Sure, coach. Huh? Emma, come with me, please. <sighs> Kick the ball, please. There. Field one, Roxbury, nothing. Let's go home. That won't count, though. 
Buddy's family. Yes. How's she doing? Well, we're, we're not quite sure, really. Well, Dad's a vet. He can help. When was the last time she ate? It's been about 20 hours. I could use a little help. has arrived. Oh my. Our little buddy. <laughs> it looks like three. to feed, clothe, and educate. Oh, my. Oh, dear, I'm quite overcome. Don't kill me. Would you like to come see them? Oh, yes. <laughs> yeah. Aren't they cute? They're so cute. Oh, look at them. Oh, they're so Buddy joined the team, it meant something. You became a part of something. You can't just quit. I don't want us to be the reason why the team can't play. It's not just up to you. We're all part of it. The team. We're in this together. I don't know. Maybe it's just better if I... It's not the same without you and Buddy. We'll miss you. You will? You will. You'll miss me. Well, just a little, babe. Come on, Steve, we're late for the game. What's this? What did you do? You have to play by the rules, son. So what, you kicked that team off because they had a dog? You really don't think we can win, do you? It was unfair play, son. That's the only reason why they won. 
They won because we didn't give it our best shot. It's that simple. Hey, Montoya here. Yeah, Stern's here. Just to let you know, the board's had a change of heart. Your dog can play. I'll, uh... I'll inform the team right away. Yeah, good luck. Webster. The coast is clear. Now get into your butler outfit, get over to the Putter Mansion, and open the front gate. That's not good. Shh. What do we do? You get the dog. I'll get the puppies. In Molly. Get the puppies. Come on, let's go. Come on, let's go. Daddy. 
Ash, what's wrong with Molly? Somebody's stolen her babies. Come in, this is Kibbles, 911. Fitz, are you there? Kibbles, this is Fitz. I read you, over. This is the big one, Puffy Nappers. What are we gonna do? We'll start at the dog pound and you bring your gear, over. Hey, hey, uh, go get changed, all right? And get that box ready. Josh? Andrea? Buddy? Well, we already left for the game. Better get there early if we want to get seats. Just give me two minutes, I'll be ready. That's him. That's the fellow that locked me up, Webster's mate. You get the other one. You know this man. Snurbert? Ah, he doesn't work here anymore. He was fired. Where does he live? Ah, uh, somewhere past the tracks on the east side. Andrew, Tammy, come on! Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the league championship game between the Springbrook Spartans and the Fernfield Timberwolves. from the United States Women's World Cup soccer team, Brianna Scurry! Well, all the hype is finally over, Brad, and now comes down to 90 minutes of soccer till we crown this year's league champions. Yes, Ted, all the marbles are on the table this afternoon. And you're not going to believe this, folks, but word has it that the Fernfield Timberwolves will be starting the game today without three of their key players. Yes, apparently Fernfield star players Emma Putter, Josh Fram, and the famous Air Bud are missing from the field. This is really an unfortunate turn of events for the Timberwolves. Especially when you consider that the Spartans' all-star captain, Steve Stearns, has finally returned from the injury list. The pressure is on Fernfield this afternoon. I don't know how they can hold it together. Where on earth can we be? It's not like Josh to be late. Let's go up here. You just wait here, okay? But Josh, there's a... I'm serious. Andrea, stay here. <laughs> Right through here. Come on, we'll get the puppies. Molly, over here. Come on. Andrew, what are you doing? I thought I told you to wait outside. Hey. Did you hear something? Yeah. Maybe you better check it out. Oh. Hello? Is anybody out there? It's okay, boss. It's just some wagon tails. What do you mean, wagon tails? Hey, wait a minute. Uh -oh. Let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. take early control of the ball. Go, 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 go. Breaking away is Stearns. He's in the clear. Burnfield is scrambling past the Stearns. And a goal! Yes! Beautiful goal. The Spartans take the early lead only oh. 45 seconds into the game. It's 1-0. Burnfield's already in trouble. Grab the dog whistle out of my bag, all right? It's just in the back there. Right here. Right here. Right here. Right here. One, two, three, go. Go! Oh, and the 
referee calls a handball in the box against the Spartan defenseman. That's a big break for the Timberwolves. Sam Drake is going to get a penalty kick and has a chance to tie the game. Good, you gotta do it! This will put Fernfield right back into it. Come on, Sam. Here it goes, your Sam. And a goal! We're all tied at one. That was a beautiful kick by Drake, and the Timberwolves have some new life in this game. You want me to do it? Pull! Pull! You hear something, boss? Get back to work. You hear that, don't you, boss? Come on, Webster! by stealing our dogs. He wanted to get rich. What, sir? I just wanted a puppy. Ever since I was a kid, I always wanted one. He was gonna sell it. Be quiet.
They're one goal down with less than four minutes to play, and the team is looking dog tired. Yes, Daddy. Daddy, look! Oh, here they are. No puppies. Oh, good. Mm -hmm. There we are. Here they are! Let's go. This way. Some sort of commotion down on the field. Well, the crowd's going crazy. It's Buddy. Air Bud is back. Oh, but not a moment too soon. Fernfield's missing players, Emma Putter, Josh Fram, and Air Bud are back. Get in there, Buddy. You know your spot. Emma on the right side. Mike, clap back. Both are back. <laughs> now we got a game, dude. Now we got a game. Yes, sir. Right, go. <laughs> Buddy's incredible. Thanks. Great team. Congratulations, coach. Thank you, Jack. Well played. Well done, guys. You guys played great. Buddy's incredible. Brianna, scary. I'm Emma, and this is Josh. Hi. Hey, Josh. Nice to meet you. This is Buddy. Nice to meet you, Buddy. Nice hitter. Maybe we could play sometime. Yeah. Awesome. Nice. Well, I'll be keeping my eyes on you guys. Cool. Great. Does it get any better than this? The championship on the line and the world is watching. And here we are again. Who will be the new World Cup champion? Can they do it? It all comes down to a shootout between the U.S. and Norway. American goalkeeper Brianna Scurry will now face the Norwegian striker with her team down two goals to one. And this is huge pressure on Scurry. She needs to stop this shot. <laughs> what a save by Scurry. The USA is right back into it. Now it's up to Brandy Chastain of the US. She has a chance to pull the Americans even at two if she can put this kick past the Norwegian keeper. Outstretched hands of the goalkeeper, it's all tied at two. Now the pressure switches back to Brianna Scurry, who faces Norway's fourth kicker. She needs to stop this one to prevent the Norwegians from taking the lead. <laughs> Wait a minute, folks. Scurry is down, and she appears to be injured. She's slowly getting up, but she's definitely in a lot of pain. This will be a terrible break for the Americans if she can't continue. Norway still has one more kick, and things are not looking good for the U.S. The next kicker for the Stars and Stripes is Tisha Venturini. She's been in this situation before and is no stranger to the pressure. If she can make this one, the Americans can pull ahead by one goal and put the heat squarely back on their opponents. 
There's no doubt about that one. What a rocket. This really puts the Americans in the driver's seat. Brianna Scurry has made her way back to the net, but it's obvious she's in a lot of pain. There's movement at the U.S. bench. The coach is signaling, I don't believe it. The U.S. has designated Buddy Fram to replace Scurry. Frank, you kidding? A dog? That's not a smart move, I'd say. They'll make puppy chow out of this pooch. Go get him! <laughs> I hope this works. They say he's pretty good. Come on, buddy! You can do it! But magic, Frank. Nothing but air bud. Right. 
There's nothing to say, but you can see it right there.